Robotics are playing a much bigger role on the farm these days, and now a Valley company is unveiling a robotic ag sprayer, offering precision application with just a, a touch of a button. Well, the new robot is filling a void when it comes to safety, accuracy, and manpower. Action News anchor Dale Wrong shows us the driverless rig already working its way through Valley Orchards. Dale? Jason and Margo, the DeLorean of spray rigs might look like it belongs in a showroom, but this vehicle is moving the ag industry forward at a very measured pace. Orchards and vineyards are sprayed with everything from pesticides to fertilizer. But this spray rig doesn't need a tractor or a driver. GUS runs by itself. GUS stands for Global Unmanned Spray System. Crinklaw Farm Services in Kingsburg incorporated the old, the same fan and drive shaft with the new electronic software which allows the vehicle to be self-guided and self-propelled. That's just where ag's headed, you know, you see all the autonomous cars everywhere and agriculture slowly catching up to that. We're really the first ones to bring it to market. Gus looks like it's built for speed, but it moves slowly among the trees, delivering precise amounts of spray row by row. This is a game changer for a lot of growers. It's going to make their lives better through efficiency, through accuracy, and safety. Instead of driving a tractor to spray the trees, the operator can be a mile away from where chemicals are being sprayed. It's helping us and the growers and, fill, and filling a void. You know, there's problems finding ag labor these days. This takes that out of it when it comes to spraying. Gus gives us a glimpse into the future of farming. The company worked on Gus for three years before they got it right. Crops ranging from almonds and peaches to citrus and grapes all need to be sprayed. Daily Wrong, ABC 30 Action News.